Hey guys, welcome to another edition of Pike and Walleye Hunters. Um, just getting up in the morning here. We're heading out to Crawlin Valley Reservoir. It's about 11 o'clock, so I should probably be there in, in about an hour. Um, yeah, we're going to be doing uh, jaw jackers and some tip ups. It's pretty nice out, so I'm not bringing the tent today, but um, it's looking really, really nice out. A lot of people have to go back to work and um, hide out for a while, so I'm kind of happy about that so uh <laughs> not rubbing it in or anything but uh yeah i'm gonna get on the road here and uh hopefully get our lines in the water in about an hour hey guys uh we're just gonna stop and uh get my tim hortons here nothing's like a road trip without a, a good tim hortons in you good old double double here so stop in strathmore Nice today. Hi, uh, large double double, please. Yeah, box of ten bits. A box of ten bits, the regular or the ten beef? Uh, just the regular. Anything else? No, that's it. Perfect. Yeah, that's all Ten bits too. Can't have not the Justin Bieber ones, but regular ten bits. I just for 50. Tim's card. Debit today? It's a debit there. Debit? Yeah. Thanks. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Now we are good to go. See you guys out at the lake in probably about a, well, Google says about a half an hour, so. Just got out to uh, the north end of uh, Crawlin Valley Reservoir here. Um, see, there's one guy. He's uh, he's kind of fishing in the front there. I see a couple of couple of trucks, but not too many. So I think I'm gonna try. Oh, I don't know. Probably west of here a little bit, and then get the line set up and get in the water. So. Hey guys, I uh, just got out here, uh, just got my tip up set up, I got one there with a the bell on it, and then I got another one with a bell on it, and uh, minnow on a uh, single hook there, and uh, it's nice out, there's uh, nobody out here, I'm at the north end of uh, Crawling Valley, there's like zero wind right now, it's great, so um, my auger blades are kind of dull, so I really beat the hell out of myself drilling these holes here so I got to get new blades but uh, yeah so I'm gonna wait and uh, it's pretty nice out so I'm gonna sit here watch my tip ups it's a great week to be fishing I feel sorry for all you that got to work this week but um, that doesn't mean the bite's gonna be good so but uh, yeah we'll uh, wait and see what happens here uh, two holes drilled if I don't get anything here I, I might drill a couple more holes here it's gonna be lunchtime uh, pretty soon I got that big spaghetti from from last week that I made there so uh, i probably fire that up on the stove here in a bit but uh, I got my bells on there if I hear something I'm gonna run like uh, she stole it so uh, not getting any bites or anything so I got my stove here got my spaghetti from uh, a couple days ago. So, uh, let's get this out. I'll take this. Uh, dump it into there. Just let that heat up. Hopefully that should be ready in a couple minutes. But 
As you can see, my, uh, my tip up is motionless right now. So, uh, nothing I can do about that. Maybe I'll give it some spaghetti, but. <laughs> Uh, spaghetti's pretty much done, so it's windy as hell right now, so I figured I'd use my car as a wind block towards the uh, Hey guys, uh, just uh, jumping in the car here to eat some lunch, but um, I got my tip up to my left of me and I'm just kind of watching it. I'm kind of using my car as a wind block right now because the wind's just really picked up. It's really crazy, but uh, no bites today, but I'm eating good. They're not. I put down what I thought they might like and uh, trying the north end here. Uh, I might try a uh, little bit more further down, maybe by the boat launch or kind of more west next time but um yeah i'm just gonna eat this and keep an eye on my tip up and if nothing happens and uh i guess that's a day so yeah but this is the baked spaghetti i made looks pretty good i can't wait to jump into it and uh yeah so we'll see if uh we'll see if something happens hopefully the wind doesn't it's a one of those fray bill dog bone tip ups um they're great uh kind of wind resistant one of the reasons I kind of like them, but uh, yeah, nothing's uh, nothing's popping up here, so but that's fishing. So, anyways, I'm gonna chow down. I'll probably see you guys in a minute. Hey guys, I'm back. It's been about a half an hour, and I am walking over to my one tip up here that's been sitting here motionless for the last half an hour, and my other tip up it's been sitting here for about the same amount of time and uh been sitting here reading and i haven't heard this go off so just been sitting here and nothing's been going on that's a sp fray bill spider tip up by the way i don't know if you guys ever seen one of those bought them a couple years ago they're pretty good so um we can actually see i am going to go over to where those trees are just off that point it's pike and walleye kind of like points like that and um, I'm gonna I'm gonna try there I'm gonna bust out a couple more holes it might kill me but uh, I'm gonna do that and if I don't catch anything I'm probably gonna have lunch and uh, probably head her back here so but yeah it's uh it's a gorgeous day out here at crawling valley it's there's nobody around because Oh, well, like I, everybody's working except for me. So well, today, anyway. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm just slowly, slowly taking it. Yeah. Oh my goodness! And it's a nice walleye. <laughs> Woo! Oh my goodness. Forgive me for the way I... But he is... He is a nice size. I gotta get a bump board for this. But, uh, yeah. Uh, look at the size of this fish, guys. Gamagatsu hook. Doesn't look like it's coming out here, but. Alright. Oh my soul. What a nice looking fish. Apologize, guys. He's tangled up in my. But, yeah. It's gonna be decent size. I'm just gonna get my 
bump board here and uh, I'm just gonna wham real quick and uh, get back. about two pounds, 50 centimeters. All right. So, let's get him back in the water for a live release here. guys.